six when I got here. I uh, just got on the water a few minutes ago. It's 6.30 now. Water temperature is 50 degrees. So it's cooler now. Maybe that spec might will be rocking this morning. Let's hope it is. Catch up for you in just a few minutes. Guys, it is cold this morning. Water temperature right now, it's going up from what it was. Uh, but right now it's 58, 58.8 degrees. I'm trying to get that trout bite this morning. And uh, yeah, it was, it's pretty chilly, but hopefully I can get up here where I want to get and get on some trout. But the air temperature is like 43 degrees, I think right now, it's cold. It is cold. I got the little rants rolling right there. We're marking fish everywhere, so that's a that's a good sign. Trolling one rod out this side, and one rod out that side. So hopefully we can get on a topwater bite here in a few minutes. We're just about where we need to be. Takes takes a little lot longer than what I thought to get down here. Guys, I do want to say that uh, if you're in the market for some good glasses, I've got these gins. I'll put in a link in the description below. The company's gins, J-I-N-S. I wear progressives. I've got another pair of sunglasses right here. Um, they got over 600 pair styles and frames and everything to choose from if you order you a pair of sunglasses from them use uh coupon code southern outdoors 15 they give you 15 dollars off any any frame up to 120 dollars all you do is get your prescription if you need a prescription they, they can do that too just go on the website put it in there or call them and they'll hook you up Anyway, just wanted to throw that out there to you. I'm getting older. I need glasses. I've had LASIK in the past, and uh, it's done wore off. <laughs> so now I'm needing glasses again. So anyway, let's get to fishing, guys. Good morning. Strike. Let's see if I can get the hit again. Ah, finally got Finally caught me a little trail. It's a little guy. It's a little guy. It's a little 
little guy. Caught it on the voodoo. We was the same fish I caught the other day. It's like about the same one. <laughs> as soon as I started trolling, boom, caught one. sandbar right now. nice that was nice guys I wasn't really prepared for that <laughs> guys it's cold see what the temperature is right now it's cold forty eight degrees feels like forty five cold weather at all as you pop a tail these 
face masks do help a lot though. I do have to say that. Guys, if you never if you never been trout fishing before, if you got an area where you know those trout or think those trout, a good thing to do is just stick a, a voodoo shrimp. Uh just troll it like what I'm doing. Um, I'm just going real slow, just letting Bangley the wind push me, and I'm just steering as I go. Um, that's a great way to pick up, pick up some trout, you know. Whoa, or something else. Another good trout. Got that normal crankbait. <laughs> As I was saying, <laughs> that's a good way to catch some fish. <laughs> mm, all right. As I was saying, <laughs> it's a great way to pick off some trout. Uh, they hit bitter shrimp, they hit divers, they hit a lot of different things. Uh, jigs, um, swim baits, all, all kinds of stuff like that. But um, That's a great way to, to, to catch some fish when the fish ain't hitting what you normally think they would be hitting. Try, try some, try it. Try trolling, and you don't have to go real deep. Just if you got a depth finder, you know, see what the depth is, and then see if you see any fish. And then I just basically got through out there about 20 foot behind the boat, letting it drift. So, um, yeah. So let's put this in back. So I've got two on the voodoo shrimp and one on this little this, this little diving plug i mean ain't really much to it it's just a small little diving plug about a couple inches long got a little lip on it it might go probably six eight foot deep maybe i don't know if it goes that deep or not but i just got it Got it back there. Whoa, there's another one. Well, I had one. I had one hit that. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Yeah, boy. That's another good one. That's another one. Yeah, that is another good one. It's all about that. Can't see with a bunch of water on there. Hoop. all right there's your trolling <laughs> that was another probably 16 inch something like that 16 17 inches it's nice pretty it's fun See if we can get another one. <laughs> uh, 
that founder is lit up with them. There's fish everywhere under the boat right now. cookie cutter trout. Nice. All on the voodoo. Well, except for that one so far. He's on that diving plug. Oh, guys, I just, I do want to say, if you're looking for yourself a, a good uh, net, uh company sent this to me. It's a floating net. Um, it just folds up, handle goes in and out and everything. It's it's, it's nice, especially if you drop you if you have a tendency to drop stuff in the water. <laughs> and sometimes I do that, so uh, this is a good net. Um, I, I'm not sure if the company has actually put it put it out yet for sale, but if it, if they have, and then when it does, I'll put a link in the description below. But I'm really enjoying this. It's a good night. another guy that I caught trolling. Pretty.
Where are you? I'm going a big 1.5 mile an hour. What I'm going, 1.5 to 2 mile an hour. That's about the gist of what I'm traveling here.
guys so uh just wanted to finish up the video here and uh let you know we had a had a good morning uh turned out to be a good morning anyway uh caught several several trout uh decent size um it was slow to begin with for the first hour and a half two hours it was pretty doggone slow and uh and it's just started started trolling and because i was getting ready to go back to the house and I ain't, I ain't caught nothing. I ain't, I ain't had no more bites or anything. And I, boom, boom, boom. I started hitting left and right on that voodoo shrimp. I, I said, I did catch one on a little diver, uh, but that, that was it on that diver. Everything else was on a voodoo shrimp. So I was really pleased with this morning. We probably caught eight or 10, something like that. Uh, I, I can, I, I'm not sure exactly the number. Um, I had to look back at the video and see how many I actually count uh, caught. But uh, yeah, had a good had a good day. And guys, uh, again, if you want a good pair of sunglasses, uh, prescription or non-prescription, I'll leave a link in the description below. Uh, there, these are Gins, J I N S. Uh, I put all the all the information uh, where I got mine at. You can get prescription or. Uh, and regular glasses like this right here that I wear. Um, so guys, just be sure to check them out. Uh, tell them I sent you. Uh, use Southern Outdoors 15, get $15 off. Any pair of sunglasses up to $120. Uh, they're, they're awesome sunglasses. Uh, they got over 600 pairs to choose from. Um, I mean, you, you know, the, block the glare the good for you know got the uv rays all that junk you know about all that stuff um it's just they're just good sunglasses i i uh, I, I, I can't say enough of good things about them they look good they wear good um i mean what you know what more can you say uh affordable price for what they are uh for the quality they are they're 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 a good price so in the market for looking for for good sunglasses check out jeans all right guys till next time hopefully we'll uh hopefully we'll get back down here before too long but uh thanks for watching hit that subscribe button hit that like button y'all take care be safe and uh got any comments questions all that leave them in the comment section below god bless you